All right, so we're going to do a quick video to demonstrate our uh, new stopper for our Innova Tools modular brake. Uh, so you guys must be aware that we've been doing stoppers for other brands of brakes for many years now. Uh, but when it came down to revising that version and that model to fit our Innova Tools modular brake, we decided to take it a next step further to, to make it even more efficient. Uh, we'll show it from the side here. Uh, obviously, you would be using uh, the stoppers closer to the middle of the brake where you'd be bending your material. But just for a showcasing perspective, we'll show it from the side so that you guys can clearly see what's going on. So obviously each kit comes as a pair. So you'll have a left one and a right one to be used on the brake. And we also have the option of having one or two stopper, which is uh, an option that's not available on the uh, stopper for the other brands of brake. The idea of this is to have two preset measurements. So as you'll see here, we have the model with the two stoppers and obviously there's two sets of stops on the other side as well of the material stopper so in the end if you have the two pair option you'll have four of those flags if you have the one pair option you'll have one on each side uh, to give it, giving you a total of two stops uh, so basically super simple you'll see here we have our thumb screw and now everything is reachable from the front so typically obviously you'd be standing in the front and then you'd be closer to the material you're bending. But the idea is to undo the thumb screw and then you can relocate to wherever you want to adjust your stopper to fit the different length of brake. And the beauty of our design, which is something that's not available on the other brands of brake, is that it rotates. So basically you can preset your first measurement to whatever distance. So let's say we want to cut a piece at 16 inches. We'll set it to 16. If we want our second piece to be cut at eight inches, we'll set it to eight inches. So our first cut would be at 16 here. When we're done and we want our second cut, we rotate and then we do our second cut on the other side. So this really allows you to have preset measurements without needing to relocate those stoppers. If you need the full length of the brake, the full access to the brake, you just rotate them up and then you have, there's no stopper obviously. So. The, you'll also notice here that we have two measurements on the stopper. So we have one that calculates the offset for the cutter. So it gives you that one inch offset that our cutter has on front of the brake. And you have the other measurement which, which calculates the distance to the stainless edge. So if you're cutting with a razor blade knife or if you want to do a bend, you would be using the measurement on the left hand side. Obviously, this model has two stops like we've discussed in the past. So there would be there's engraving, laser engraving on both sides. So you can adjust your two presets measurements on the um, model with a single uh, stopper flag. There is engraving only on one side. You'll also notice the other design that we've done and we have offered with the other brands as well is our flag. So our flag is a little weird in shape if you will uh, but that was designed int intentionally so basically we have the backstop here that has an arrow pointing that says measurement to the side so whenever you're lining yourself up on a measurement regardless of which scale you're on this is your actual measurement reading the reason we did it this way is because whenever you want to set your measurement because the way it's designed you can't go any less than five and a quarter because you're hitting the, the mount that's on the top of the anvil. So if you wanted to uh, have more reach, what we've done is we've designed it so that you can rotate it and now you'll have your measurement. So measurement minus three inches here because the face of the stop here is three inches ahead of the line here. So whenever you're lining up on a measurement here, minus three inches is your actual measurement. So if you're at five and a quarter here, so I'll you can clearly see here that you can go all the way down to two and a quarter distance. So this is why we've designed it this way to, to allow you measurements less than five and a quarter. All right, so this pretty much sums up the uh, details of our uh, material stopper offered for our uh, Innova Tools modular brake. So we'll do other videos where we show those in action and how we would use it in a, in a conventional manner. Uh, but at least I hope this answers some of your questions about how and the whys of every feature of the material stopper. If you have any questions, obviously reach out to us. We'll be happy to assist you and make sure you keep following us on social media and YouTube uh, to see all the in-action shots uh, and videos coming up shortly.